uh, duo farmer so one of the reason why we highlight the stock uh, because the stock ongoing uh, uptrend is pretty much intact and the reason so called corrective move was unable to break beyond um uh only get 45 cent um you can take a look over here how the stock keep testing the 200 day moving average and of course the uh 61.8 Fibonacci level which is also the recent major resistance turning into a support zone uh, the uptrend that we draw since low 2022 last year uh was pretty much intact and did not uh, violate any what we call that um any level yet and it's not been revised so because of that you can see the new high yellow structure was uh, pretty much uh, quite supportive so yesterday again was packed by a higher slightly higher trading volume momentum also turning much more positive and we expect the uptrend to continue as we put our next technical target at 1.68 cent and 1 ringgit 82 cent meanwhile a support again at 1 ringgit 45 cent then we have Fronken. Um, Fronken has been in my radar for quite some time, um, but we did not uh, re-highlight it um, because I want to see a stronger uh, or noticeable uh, momentum movement before we re-highlight again. Previously, it was our um, buy on 11 January, again about 8.23%, slightly above um, at our uh, first target at 38 cent. The subsequent consolidation saw the stock is actually building a new baseline right above the 38.2 Fibonacci level and of course the the major resistance turned into the support level at right during at 92 cent so um yesterday gap up um on the back of high trading volume momentum improving and if you notice over here is a breakout move on the RSI suggesting the momentum start to build it up strongly and the stock also you can see here is uh, trading above the short term downtrend line so because of that we think there's a decent chance for the stock to resume their prior uptrend and continue challenging their recent high so we uh, retreat our buy with the technical um, or the support level stop loss level below at 2 ringgit 92 cent meanwhile technical target will be at 3 ringgit 38 cent and 3 ringgit 70 cent which is uh, pretty much our earlier uh, target and last but not least will be Inari Inari uh, despite trading in the downward mode um, you can see the downtrend still pretty much ongoing but um, it appears that stock have found a support right within 2 ringgit 30 cent uh, region and there is an interesting movement over here whereas the stock price uh, forming a so-called new lower low structure but the RSI or momentum in general creating a new high low structure so that means there is a, a bullish divergence so the bullish divergence um, was pretty much um, validated following yesterday gain on the back of the stock closing above the 20 day moving average over here um, trading volume a little bit on the lighter side but, uh, but at least it's actually start to improve so we think there's a decent chance for the new um, up cycle to begin and start to challenge the even resistance at 2 ringgit 55 cent and 2 ringgit 75 cent while the support should be at the major support 2 ringgit 31 cent